Did you see this? Lead has been found in over a dozen popular protein powders. Consumer Reports tested for lead and other heavy metals in 23 popular protein products, and more than two-thirds of them did, in fact, have heavy amounts of lead. Now, this may surprise you, but the plant-based protein powders and shakes were actually the worst offenders. As you can see here, nearly all the plant-based products did have elevated levels of lead, but some were particularly concerning. Two of them had so much lead that experts cautioned against using them at all. Consumer Reports broke this down into products that they would not recommend at all, products that they would recommend some usage of, and then products that they would recommend regular usage of. I have to admit, I was very surprised to see Naked at the top of the list. So Consumer Reports is using this scale to dictate where these products fall on their list. So as you can see, Naked is more than 1,500% over that daily max and clearly also surpassing the weekly max. And that's the same case for Huel. These were the protein powders that they recommended using once per week. So you can see that this is very drastic in terms of the numbers that we just saw. This, those numbers were three times more than the numbers that we're seeing here. And so these are recommended to take once a week. Now, it was not all bad. Just like I was surprised to see Naked, I was pleasantly surprised to see Own also listed on here as one of the recommendations of regular consumption. And shout out to Muscle Tech. They were the only product that I saw on the list that had no limit at all. So what do you think of all this? Is this going to change the way that you purchase and consume your protein products? Let me know in the comments below.